many things. Oh no. Oh shit show. I make a lot of strange things. Burgers. It's huge. And review products. Makeup tutorials. Playing with rouge. Playing with rabbits. Before I even start this, let me begin with a disclaimer. I love Madonna. I was raised on Madonna. I grew up watching Madonna do all of the things that everyone else saw her do that changed generations and changed people and changed society as a whole and a lot of it for the better. I've always looked up to Madonna, I've always loved her style, I've always loved her kind of unique way of sort of presenting things artistically. I've always enjoyed it, but I think as a society, it's time for us to have a conversation about Madonna. Madonna is fucking out of control. Madonna is doing insane shit. Madonna is exposing teenage girls' naked bodies on stage. Now, while I know there's a lot of perverts out there that would find that really interesting, it doesn't change the fact that this girl is underage. This this girl is just, no, just, just no, no so many times. She gets shit-faced on stage. Well, you know. I mean, she's 57 years old. She's allowed to have a drink. But I could probably argue that there is a time and a place for everything. And maybe while dressed like a clown on a tricycle on stage in front of thousands of people probably isn't the best time to do that. I'm just suggesting. Whatever, fuck you, I'm Madonna. Which, if any of you know anything about Madonna, you know, you know, the whole thing with Madonna and Guy Ritchie and their son Rocco and how it didn't work out and all this other stuff. And, um, I am very worried that Madonna might kind of be going a little insane. Um, I noticed on her MDMA tour, MDNA tour, she started getting a little crazy. Like, she started doing some stuff that people were just like, Madonna, you probably shouldn't do that. And, you know, she was all, you know, whatever, fuck you, I'm Madonna. And she did it anyway. But the, some of the videos I've been seeing surface lately kind of make me think that Madonna needs an intervention. Like, why is there no one sitting down with her going, okay, Madonna... You're behaving like a crazy person that's out of control. Maybe you should stop. Maybe you should just have several seats. Just sit the fuck down for a minute. And look at your life and look at your choices. And realize that you're acting like a fucking crazy person. You're destroying your life. You're destroying your son's life. You're, you know, fuck Guy Ritchie, whatever. But... The point is, is that she has children to think about. And while I get that Madonna, like, insulates her children from a lot of media and television and stuff like that, there is really no way to avoid those things when, when they are brought up in court for your custody hearing, for your child, who's, I think, around the same age, not too far in age away from the girl you exposed in front of an audience of people. Whatever, fuck you, I'm Madonna. Probably not the best idea. I mean, Madonna is an amazing businesswoman. I love Madonna. But Madonna's starting to scare me because Madonna's getting crazy. And Madonna, you know, she's kind of around that age. Like, Cher didn't... Cher, I don't know what the hell's on. Cher's an alien. But 
Madonna's kind of around that age where people can kind of start getting a little senile. And Madonna's never really been one to drink a lot, do a lot of drugs. She's never really been someone to do that a whole lot. So the fact that she is makes me a little concerned. I don't know why I'm concerned about Madonna. I don't know Madonna. Uh, my friend Rachel knows Madonna, but I don't personally know Madonna. Uh, but when people behave in certain ways, it's indicative of things that are going on inside of them. And Madonna's behaving like a crazy person. Plain and simple. She's behaving like, what kind of crazy person? I don't know. I'm not going to diagnose her. But I will say that she's someone who has lived in an insulated bubble for like 30 years. Who is really out of touch with reality. Whatever. Fuck you. I'm Madonna. So that can only get worse. That's not really something that gets better with time. <laughs> That's something that gets worse with time. And I think that that as as a society, it's very important that we have a conversation about Madonna. You know, when your grandmother gets too old to drive because she has fucking cataracts and she can't see, does that make you an asshole for saying, Grandma, maybe you should let mom drive? Maybe you should let anyone else drive who doesn't have a layer of tissue growing over their pupil. Nothing wrong with having medical conditions. They happen. But you have to understand the limitations of them. If you're somebody that has a broken knee, you shouldn't try to walk on it just so you can get things done. If you have cataracts, you shouldn't be driving because it's not safe. Because you can't fucking see. My grandmother had cataracts, both eyes, driving around every day. It was insane. When we found out that she had cataracts, we looked back at how long she's had these things and realized that we had been in the car with her hundreds of times, some of which we got in some wrecks, some of which, most of which, fortunately, we barely made it out. But it was always because someone else intervened at the last minute, not because she was a good driver. Madonna's kind of at that point, it seems. It seems like she's kind of at a point in her life where somebody needs to maybe like 5150 her ass. Amanda Bynes style. Like, no, no, you don't need to be doing this. Be basically bought Malawi for all intents and purposes. Not okay. Madonna has, Madonna is out of control and someone needs to intervene on her life and say, Madonna, you, you need to sit the fuck down and you need to quit your shit. You should just rest for a little while. Maybe take a holiday. Take some time to celebrate. You could really just kind of chill out. There's a place you can go and chill out in your country. And they have great medical care. They have wonderful food. There are all kinds of five-star rehab facilities that she could go to right now. I don't see her going into any, which makes me wonder if Madonna's okay. Maybe we do need to have a Madonna intervention. Maybe it's time somebody did. You know, I mean, look at Whitney Houston. That bitch died because people didn't help her because they let her get all whacked out, out of control, and nobody did anything. They were just like, oh, you try to say something to her, it's Whitney. It doesn't matter. Somebody needs to step in at some point and be like, look, you've become a self-destructive asshole, and it's not okay. At some point, people need to step in and kind of just take the reins and go, look, you're obviously not in possession of your full capacity right now, so why don't you take a break? Donna's been working for a long time, maybe she needs to take a break because she's on the way to a breakdown and better to take a break than have a breakdown. There are three videos coming out on YouTube of you in a week saying that you're having meltdowns and it's three separate occasions. Madonna, you need to sit the fuck down. You need to have a couple of seats and you need to sit there for a little while. 
and think about what you've done because you're going to ruin yourself. And I would hate to see that happen. I, I really, really would hate to see that happen. And she's worked so hard and she paved so many of the roads that people like myself walk today, which is why I'm concerned about her. Because she's not really thinking clearly. Madonna, sit the fuck down. Just fuck down for a minute. Girl.